Shalom, Israel. First of all, I like to give all honor and glory to Yahweh and Adosho Bashem Mashiach Shah. Second of all, I like to give double honor and glory to the elders who taught us the truth and paved the way for us to come in and go in this truth. I also like to give a strong shalom to the brethren who are diligent in this truth, seeking after righteousness, taking a fleeting the lust and the cares of this world. I like give you all a strong shalom and I continue all of continuing the good faith and the same and I stand against you. But today we come back with um, a quick video about um a wife. I'll probably like a name it a, a righteous and a wicked wife. But like basically this video is like not so much giving you like characteristics of a righteous and a wicked wife, but like just telling you who gets a righteous wife and who gets a wicked wife. But uh, let me start. Book of Sirach or Ecclesiastes twenty six and verse three. A good wife is a good portion. Which shall be given in the portion within the fear of the Lord. Comes up. Having a wife is a good thing. And like, uh, you're gonna get like a good wife if you fear the Lord. Now, um, I didn't plan on going on the other verse, so like, I don't know where it really it's at. Really it's at, but like, it was like a, a somewhere in the Proverbs or one of the books of Solomon wrote that said, you know, uh, have a wife had a good thing. But maybe I might have got it later and just didn't think of it. But, um, let me see. Uh, also, um, Proverb, I mean, Sarah 26, 23. A wicked woman is, is a portion to a wicked man. A godly woman is, is a godly woman is given to him in fear of the Lord. Comes like fear of a wicked man. If you have, like, a wife, multiple wives, or no wife, and you're, like, a wicked man, then, like, either your wife's wicked or the wife you're about to get. If the Lord get, gives you a wife, she's going to be wicked. But like, say you're a righteous man, or you're a single, you have one wife or multiple, like, um, like, more than likely, um, I mean, like, obviously also, like, uh, if, like, uh, when I was talking earlier about those wicked men, like, more than likely, like, you're going to have, um, uh, have them have a good wife. I mean, less than likely, the Lord can have them have a good wife. Maybe, like, she could, uh, maybe, like, um, I don't know, like, she was, like, y'all were in the world, and she came in this truth when you were wicked, or something, like, maybe to draw you in the truth, or, for some reason, but, like, more than likely, if you're righteous, and you're gonna have a righteous wife, and if you're wicked, you're gonna have a wicked wife, but as I was saying, um, if, like, um, if, like, you're righteous, whether you're single, or, if, like, you have a wife, or multiple wives, then, uh, more than likely, your wife's gonna be righteous, even though, like, you could be righteous, and, like, have a wife or wives like and they're still just wicked like you being the truth and they being the world but more than likely if you're righteous your wife is going to be righteous mm -hmm. like uh, proverbs 18 22 let me hit that real quick uh, proverbs 18 22 Whoso finds a wife find it a good thing. Con, so like, I guess I did find it after all. But like, con, like, if you like, if like you got a wife, like, it's a good thing. Like, that's to help me. If she, like, it's a righteousness. Like, it's gonna help you. And it's in a favor of the Lord. Con, so like, if you get a, like, a good wife, then like, uh, then like, the Lord has favor on you. Like, you have a, like, a help me. And somebody to, like, a, share both pain and like happiness with uh so I'm gonna go to the next uh, chapter verse 13 a foolish and a foolish son is a calamity of his father and and the contentions of a wife are continual chopping con uh I'm sorry, verse 14 but I can actually let me use verse 13 real quick. And contentions, contentions of a wife and contentious chopping. So like if a woman keeps nagging, then um, that's just going to continue. Then she's just going to continue nagging. And it's not going to be good for you. House and riches are the inheritance of fathers. And a prudent wife is from the Lord. So like like um, you, get, uh, you inherit things from your forefathers. And the um, if you get a like if you uh, if you have a prudent wife, it's from the Lord. But anyways, this is my quick video on um 
like if you're righteous, you have a righteous. If you have, if you're righteous, then you have a right. More likely, have a righteous wife. If you're wicked, when you are more likely, have a wicked wife. Which is also a way you can use to examine yourself. But anyways, I wish more to get edified, and I pray to God pray for me, and I pray for y'all, and I pray y'all pray for each other. But I like to give all honor and glory to Yahweh, and I do so. Watch you, Moshe Yahshua. Shalom.